Representation is important for many of us growing up. We didn't see many black superheroes. As in none, in my case. <laughs> but now it's becoming more common thanks to creators such as Nicole Coleman. Uh, her new book, The Super Bold Adventures of Skateboard P of the Turbo Twins, has been released. It uh, hit the shelves yesterday, and she joins us now from Houston to talk about it in the evening. And uh, congratulations. Tell us a little bit more about your book, if you will. Well, thank you guys so much for having me on today. It's truly a pleasure to be on the Black News Channel, um, especially at such a time like this. So getting an opportunity in such a, you know, a historic and chaotic and just crazy time where everything is just unorganized and just so different than what we are truly used to. It's really nice and refreshing to be amongst a presence that is um, very positive, that is very um, performative, and it's very um, forward thinking. And so I applaud you all for having this space and place for us, um, you know, the very first 24 uh, seven news channel for us by us. So just hats off to you before I even get into the book. Thank but you. the book is The Super Bowl Adventures of State and the Turbo Twins, and like you guys said, it did release yesterday, and I'm so excited about this particular project because it's a passion project of mine, and it's something that I was able to do with my three children who were actually the inspirations behind this. I wrote the book in January, pre-COVID, pre-quarantine, pre-being shut down, not knowing what was to come. And we had the opportunity together, me and the children, to creatively come up with concepts together in the quarantine and um, flush it through. And I knew that I wanted to create something really unique and special. And it's a dream of mine that I've had for over 20 years pre having children. Um, Skateboard P is six years old, um, who is my eldest son. And the Turbo Twins are actually four years old. And one of my twins is actually on the autism spectrum. And so we have a very unique family dynamic. And so I call myself the ringleader of the Coleman family circus most days because it's a whole situation at our home on any given occasion. But the big and short of it is that I'm teaching my children to love one another and others with empathy. And they have to be able to do things together and realize that they have completely unique gifts and skills. And so it's a book about teaching one another how to love, how to be patient, how to utilize and come together and accept that we have different skills, but they have to complete their missions together. And they can only do that when they come together in tandem. And it's just a mission of it's a, uh, the overall purpose is about hope, love, and pushing forward together. And at a time like this, it's um, just a positive uplift. Um, and I hope that people can respond and connect to it in such a way. It's the first installment of a three-part series. And I hope that my children, hi Preston, Mason, and Reagan, who are watching live, uh, are inspired themselves as they see how this has come to life. Because first it was the white book, because it was just on white pages and the white book became sketches and now it's truly come to life and they see that when you put hard work and dedication into something you truly are the superhero of your own story well we're, we're getting a little bit short on time but i have to ask you this um how gratifying is it to to know that you have created something here that young children can look and see us see people of color on the cover and in the pages and watch that story come to life? It is, um, I, I mean, it's, it's mind blowing. I don't know that I'm really truly grasping it just yet because my children are like, this is us. This is who we are and they feel truly super bold. And they're so proud of what this means. And they're like, you mean, Mom, other kids will be able to read these books in their home before they go to bed at night? And I'm like, absolutely. And they're like, just like us again and again. And I'm like, absolutely. And so that in itself is um, what makes my heart feel full. And I hope that it will just fuel and fill the hearts of those children and those families as well. Oh, very rewarding. Thank you so much, Nicole Coleman. We appreciate that Thank and look forward you. to seeing the book. Thank you so much. You all have a wonderful evening. I'm kind of cheered up now. <laughs>